Looking for fast, cheap, and reliable coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuckReserve.com. Head over to MuckReserve.com. They're awesome to work with. They got super cheap, fast, and reliable coins. Make sure you use code Poodle at checkout for an additional 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over the next upcoming promo, which should be coming pretty soon now. Last year, this promo dropped in two days from today. And now, typically, this year has been a bit earlier. So, I don't know how quickly it could drop, but as of now, guys, the next promo upcoming is going to be the NFL Playoff promo. Now, the NFL Playoff promo... It's pretty self-explanatory. It, it's the opening of the playoffs. Now, the NFL playoff promo has a few promos within it. Specifically being the Super Bowl promo, which is actually related, of course. That's the final week of the NFL playoff promo. And then we have the following week, which is going to be Team of the Year. Now, Team of the Year is separate from the playoff promo, but it is within it. And then we also have the NFL Honors, which comes shortly, like right before, like during the Super Bowl, but before it happens. So we have about four to five total promos this month, but... The soonest one, the one we have to be really worrying about, is going to be the playoff promo. Now, the playoff promo in certain years has been my favorite promo. In certain years, one specific one was back, I think it was, um, I want to say Madden 13, with the, when they used to have stars, it used to be like 99 three star, 99 two star. Pretty much, it was like a way to get 100 overalls. Adrian Peterson three star was one of my favorite cards ever. Now, I don't know why, but I remember it around the playoff promo, and then you got the NFL Honors card. Point being, guys, here. Point being to all this is that playoff promos in years past left some pretty significant memories. Because playoff cards are typically based on playoff performances. So, like, the year Kaepernick went crazy and went all the way to the bowl and came out of nowhere. He got a playoff card. So, like, you just remember big playoff performances from guys that may have not been maybe even big-name players, right? Kaepernick, not exactly the case there, but there's always going to be a playoff hero. There's going to be a playoff LTDs. It, rem it reminds you. It gives you the nostalgia vibe of, like, older past play performance like oh wow in 2000 uh, you know 2011 victor cruz it's like i forgot he did that so like that's that's actually pretty cool you know on this day in 2011 victor cruz went for 200 yards and sometimes you go on youtube and you look up that game because you're kind of curious but playoff promo is gonna be cool before we get into the video guys heading over to mutt reserve down below use code poodle take advantage of the 30 percent discount that's still going on pick up some coins stock up for the playoff promo as well as guys if you haven't already make sure you're going below subscribe turn the notification bell boys and join the family as well now, moving on from that, let's get into the video. So, based on overalls alone with the playoff promo, before we get into what to expect, the playoff promo, zero chill, we saw cap at around a 96 overall to 97 overalls powered up. So, I imagine the playoff promo has to start at least 96s, with the Masters being 97s, which is going to be weird then, because I guess Team of the Year's are both 98s, but overalls are getting pretty high at this point. Which leads me to believe we may be going back to the 100 overall, like, you know, 100 plus stats uh, format. That's the only way I can see this working out uh, for the long haul. So hopefully they do end up taking that route. But let's head over and go show you guys some of the playoff stuff from last year and show you guys kind of how this usually goes. We're on the playoff screen from last year. Now, this playoff, these are the playoff players last year. We had two Masters, and then typically we have one, like, we have two overall Masters for the conference, and then Team Masters. This is what's cool about Team Masters. Pretty much you get 195 overall from each team in the playoffs, which is actually super cool. So, like, uh, you know, 16 teams usually, well, now, uh, what's it called? Now four, 14 teams are making it, sorry. Seven in each conference. We have the first-round buys for both, and then we got the, um, the division winners, and then, of course, we have the, the wild cards. Now, the thing is, though, so we have a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we had 12 total. Now we're going to have 14, I believe. So there's going to be 14 playoff teams, which means we will get 14 heroes. So there's going to be 14 heroes, which is just one player from each team that really probably, like, you know, led them to the playoffs. Like, Brennan Brooks, big year. Let's just say Daniel Hunter, big year. Drew Brees, Devontae Adams. So to give you guys an example right now, so let's say the, you know, the Packers are making it right now. I would say Aaron Rodgers. But it can't be course because Aaron Rodgers got a card so it would be probably Devonta Adams again or Aaron Jones um the Chiefs would probably be that's a tough one because again the Chiefs are another team that have a lot already maybe Chris Jones again with uh with the, if the Titans were to make it it couldn't be Henry because we have one so maybe it would be Ryan Tannehill but there's just so many possibilities this promo and of course so that pretty much means we're gonna get 14 really big and good cards and then we have the NFC there's NFC, sorry, NFC, and then AFC Masters, so they're usually not much better, like they're one plus overall, so I think these will probably be 97 overalls, Now we've had Steve Smith before, we've had, um, 
who's that outside linebacker for the Patriots? With like the really curly hair. I can't remember. Point is, he was one of them as well. We've had a few really, really good ones now. I don't know who it would be this year, who are some playoff heroes. Literally anyone in the, that's ever played in the NFL has been in the playoffs. It could be them. It could, you know, it would be really cool. It would be, I'd really respect EA for this. Like, if they give us a Colin Kaepernick card, like, I know this is controversial, but at the end of the day, guys, in Madden, Colin Kaepernick cards were good. Like, they, they were nasty. And a Colin Kaepernick throwback to, was like, 2012 playoffs against the Packers. A uh, conference ship, that'd be a fun card to play with. Robert Griffin, the third master. Throwback to uh, the game before the Seahawks. The Seahawks went towards ACL, I think. So, that first game we did really well in. Unless that was the wild card game that he got hurt in. I don't remember. It was a while ago. Point is, there's a lot of good stuff that we could end up seeing. Playoff form was cool. It's a really cool promo. Then we get some LTDs. Like, we'll get, like, playoffs LTD Victor Cruz. Playoffs LTD Eli Manning. I'm a Giants fan. Disregard me. Uh, playoff LTD Tyreek Hill, let's say. Playoff LTD. Just anyone that's had a big game. Jerome Bettis. Playoff LTD. Maybe they bring out Bradshaw for the Super Bowl promo, which I could see because they always bring out those oldies. Uh, hopefully, they have his rights to him. But I could see a lot of cool stuff really coming with all this. And the playoff promo, I mean, again, they've been in... This is just last year's promo. If you remember, last year was a watered-down version of Madden. People loved it uh, in some aspects. Like, you know, YouTube viewership was high in that game. But it was a watered-down game. Like, everything we should have gotten, they took, like, 40% off of it and gave it to us, and we just accepted it like little kids. This year, they're giving, like, 40% more per promo. Like, like the Zero Trip promo, we got, I would say... 20 to 30 more things than we, we even deserve. Like, not that we didn't deserve, but that we even expected, right? Like, they gave us that Isaiah Simmons, and we would have been cool with not much else. They gave us that Mahomes, we would have been cool with not much else. They gave us, like, 30 of those. You know, those so surprise type, oh, oh my gosh, global cards. Like, they were, even their bad cards were good cards. So, I mean, they could really overdo the playoff promo this year again. Maybe Adrian Peterson playoff card. Like, does, he has some playoff wins, right? It's just so long, early in the morning, but so long ago. But there could be so many good potential opportunities with this. Now, if we click into, like, Champ Bailey, if you guys want to see some of these stats, this Champ Bailey was insane. Now, the thing with just Champ Bailey is, in this current Madden, he would be a good cornerback, not the greatest one, because, of course, we already have cards, these overalls. But 94 speed, of course, could be powered up. So, we'd have 95 speed, 99 zone, and then mid-90 press and zone. Sorry, 99 man, and then mid-90 press and zone. Now, that would be, like, a Charles Woodson right now. That would be, like, you know, Vincent, um, Steve Vincent, or whatever it was. There's so many cards like him right now, but again, we wouldn't get him. We'd probably get a 97 overall that can be powered up to a 98 because that's just the nature, again, of what we are at this game. So I could see Champ Bailey getting, you know, his card would be even better than this one. Now, again, I don't think we'll get these two cards. I don't know who we can get. Could we get modern-day players? I don't think so. History's usually been that the playoff hero is usually an older guy. So it could be anyone. We can get, like, a Tracy Porter. We can get, like, oh, well, that'd be probably the Super Bowl promo. But yeah, I'll, I'll make a separate video on the Super Bowl promo when the time just come for that, of course. I'm not going to put them together because those are two separate promos entirely. Playoffs is just a promo. The Super Bowl promo last year, a blitz and currency. So we could end up seeing a lot of that. Then we have the team of the year coming. We have so many cool promos that are coming to the game pretty soon. Hopefully. Hopefully, you know, it all goes well. Hopefully, we see some really, really good cards. And as far as the promo goes, promo, we'll have the 14 Masters. You know, they usually do that. We'll have 14 Masters. You go into it. They'll see all the Masters per team. We'll be like, Giants, Master... Eagles master, Cowboys master. Obviously, those aren't the real teams making it. I'm just thinking of the NFC East. And then we'll have the, uh, the two will be NFC and AFC set uh, set master. And that'll be the usual. You have to put like you have to put like four out of the you know eight heroes in, or or all eight of them, depending on how they're gonna do it this year. And there'll be another set like you know a wild card set. And then we'll get we'll get per round we'll get wild card LTD division or LTD conference chip LTD we'll get cool solos you may even get coin ups like we've got coin ups in the past where you pick a team that you think can make it and for everyone they get you get added stuff so like let's say in the first there's you know there's the uh, the 14 teams in the beginning you can go play a solo and you pick the the Packers you think they're gonna make it or you get a random one and as long as they as far as they make it you can go up and you can switch sell them or it'd be cool if they made it like you have to it's like a gamble right. Put your Packers token in for this week's uh, Chief token, you know, or put your Packers token. You got to pick who wins. And you make it all the, the way, and you get ten thousand training. Like, there's some really cool stuff to do with this. And of course, we're gonna get playoff packs and playoff bundles and playoff stuff. LTDs, of course, LTD galore. Maybe a house rules, but I doubt it. For the most part, I really don't expect there to be a house rules. But I will. I, th I think it'll be cool. I know we'll get some cool solo sequences. We'll probably get a free playoff hero. And then leading into the Super Bowl promo. I know it's going to go fast, guys. This month's going to go super fast. I'm telling you, it's going to go, you know, playoff promo, 
And right when you're enjoying the playoff promo, Team of the Week's Weeks 14, 15, or 15, 16, 17 all drop. And then right when you get to see that, then Team of the Year drops. And then Team of the Year is huge. And then you get past that. And then Super Bowl, NFL Honors. And it just moves fast. And then it slows down. But it moves fast, at least for the month of January. But that's pretty much wraps up today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Comment down below. Let me know what's going on. I like the video. And of course, if you guys need coins for the playoff promo, which is going to need some coins, as well as to pick up some player stuff from the Zero Chart promo, head over to my reserve down below. Use code Poodle for 30% off. Take advantage. Pick up some coins. Take advantage of the holiday discounts before the end. I'm out. See you guys later. Peace.